Hi everybody, I've been wanting to do the Kendrick Lamar video I'm about to do and react to it for over a year now since its release. But I always say I get round, but I've featured so many new artists on my channel since January of this year. It's been quite an incredible and exciting year for me because my channel is growing and growing and growing. It's what every creator on YouTube wants and I've done it the honest way. I'm hitting nearly 6,000. And so don't forget to like subscribe because you're going to get the full bio of the heart part five it's very symbolic it has some famous faces in the video i'm sure you'll spot them and not give too much away because in case you're new to kendrick lamar as always in my channel i give you a little bit of background it has to be very small this introduction because there is so many lyrics to get through and afterwards the five minute video i want to break down the video itself so if I get it's all live into it now. The Hot Part 5 is a song by the American rapper Kendrick Lamar. It was surprise released on May the 8th of last year through PG Lang. Top DAWG Entertainment, Aftermath Entertainment and Interscope Records as part of a promotional single to help anticipate the release for Lamar's fifth studio, studio album, Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers, where it was later in, included as a streaming bonus track. Now it's the fifth part in his Heart Song series, following the Heart Part 4, that was in 2017, his so, first solo release in over four years. Now this was last year. Now the song received five nominations at the 65th annual grammy awards just think about that include after so many years this song got that much recognition you'll see why when you watch it it included record of the year song of the year best music video best best uh, sorry about this i'm trying to speed it up to get through this the best music video best rap performance and best rap song eventually winning the latter two now that's all we need to know about kendrick he is for all my followers throughout the world he is an american rapper and songwriter known for his progressive as you're going to hear him sing musical styles and socially conscious songwriting it's incredible the lyrics are so deep and so much he's often considered one of the most influential hip-hop artists of his generation he certainly is and he was born and raised in Compton, California. That's as much as you need to know. We need to get into the song straight away. It is a work of genius, lyrically motivating and very symbolic. That's all I'm going to say about the video that you're about to watch. Let's watch, let's listen to Kendrick Lamar and then you'll have the full breakdown. I have to time myself, perfect full breakdown of the lyrics and the symbolism that's involved in this masterpiece you're about to hear. You'll be glad I introduced you to this particular artist in 2023. From a generation of pain will murder his minor Rebellious and more jealous, a chip you for designer Belt buckles and cloud overzealous and prone to violence Make the wrong turn, be your will of the will alignment Residue burn, miss that in the city Miscommunication to keep homo detector busy No protection is risky, desensitized, I vandalize pain Covered up and camouflage, get used to hearing arsenal rain Analyze, risk your life, take the charge Homies don't fuck your baby mama once you hit the yard That's culture, 23 hour lockdown Did somebody call, said your little nephew was shot down The culture's involved I done seen niggas do 17 Hit the halfway house Get out and get his brains blown out Looking to buy some weed Car washes played out New GoFundMe accounts to proceed A brand new victim will shatter those dreams The culture Do this 
for my culture To let y'all know what a nigga look like in a bulletproof rover In my mama's sofa was a doodle popper Hair trigger, walk up closer, ain't no photoshopping Friends bipolar, grab you by your pockets No option if you froze up, I always play the offense Niggas going to work and selling work, late for work Working late, praying for work, but he on paperwork That's the culture, point the finger, promote ya Remote location, witness protection, they go hold ya The streets got me fucked up, y'all can miss me I wanna represent for us New revolution, what's up and moving? I'm in Argentina, wiping my tears full of confusion Water in between us, another peer's been executed History repeats again, make amends Then find a nigga with the same skin to do it But that's the culture, crack a bottle Hard to deal with the pain, we are sober By tomorrow, once we get the remains, we start over That's the problem, our foundation was trained To accept whatever follows Dehumanized, insensitive, scrutinized The way we live for you and I Enemy shook my hand, I can promise I'll meet you In a land where no equal is your equal Never say I ain't told ya Nah In a land where hurt people hurt more people Fuck calling it culture Celebrate new life when it come back around The purpose is in the lessons we learning now Sacrifice personal gain over everything Just to see the next generation better than ours I wasn't perfect, the skin I was in I truly suffered Temptation and patience, everything that the body nurtures I felt the good, I felt the bad, and I felt the worry But all in all, my productivity has stayed urgent Face your fears, always knew that I would make it here Where the energy is magnified and persevered Consciousness is synchronized and crystal clear Euphoria is glorified and made his Reflecting on my life and what I done Paid dues, made rules, change out of love Them same views made schools change curriculums But didn't change me staring down the barrel of that gun Should I feel resentful I didn't see my full potential? Should I feel regret about the good that I was into? Everything is everything, this ain't coincidental I woke up that morning with more heart to give you As I bleed through the speakers, feel my presence To my brother, to my kids, I'm in heaven To my mother, to my sis, I'm in heaven To my father, to my wife, I am serious, this is heaven To my friends, make sure you count them blessings To my fans, make sure you make them investments And to the killer that spared up my demise I forgive you, just know your soul's in question I seen the pain in your pupil when that trigger had squeezed And though you did me gruesome, I was surely relieved I completed my mission, wasn't ready to leave But fulfilled my days, my creator was pleased I can't stress how I love y'all I don't need to be in flesh just to hug y'all The memories recollect just because y'all Celebrate me with respect, the unity we protect is above all And Sam, I'll be watching over you Make sure my kids watch all my interviews Make sure you live out our dreams we produce Keep that genius in your brain on the move And to my neighborhood, let the good prevail Make sure them babies and the leaders out of jail Look for salvation when troubles get real Cause you can't help the world until you help yourself And I can't blame the hood the day that I was killed You had to see it, that's the only way to feel And though my physical won't reap the benefits The energy they carry on admit still I want you Well, I just have to say That incorporated a lot of one lines That represented the artists he featured facially In that video, and it'll make sense Wow, it was powerful, I could understand it, and for all the people, the lyrics will not come up in the video. Go If you want a translation of the lyrics, you'll have to go to the description of my video here, my reaction, because there's so many. It would confuse the video, take away from what he's saying, if you, under, if you do understand English, and just take away from the powerfulness of the masterpiece that was Kendrick Lamar, The Heart Part 5. Let's get going now. On the rare occasions that Kendrick Lamar drops new music that we just heard, and this was last year, the music world always stops because he releases it every so couple, a little bit every couple of years. That's why. 
and we all pay close attention. I think lyrically you understand why. His music is densely packed, as we've seen, with symbolism, as I've talked about three times already, and deeper meaning that it demands detailed analysis, which is what I'm about to do. Now, Kendrick's, this was this time around May, his new song, and it was leading up to that album from this Compton genius that he is. And, you know, the video faces morphed as we've seen into OJ Simpson, which is very recognizable, Kanye West, which is very recognizable, Jussie Smollett as well, Kobe Bryant, Will Smith and Nipsey Hussle. Now I only put five, did that five, but the other two came up halfway through. And as he raps, each, each of them and each of their perspective on whom they were, instance that made them famous or whatever, came up in the lyrics. That's why it needs you need to recognize and interlink the faces with the words in the lyrics that they were singing, even though it was Kendrick singing, that they were, let's say, improvising on. That would be the best word. And between the lyrics, the production, the music videos you've seen, and the border context proves what a fabulous, fabulous artist of worth he truly is, isn't he? That was just incredible. And I got through that. Most rap records, I can't. I switch off because I don't understand them. They, they, they always hold guns in videos. And this was almost like a detox, stripping it away so you focalize on the performance the images, the symbolism and the lyrics, which I think is much more important than the actions and the drama and all of that that others do. So anyway, this is the fifth instalment, as I said, of Kendrick's The Heart series, which I didn't know there was a part four, part three, part two, until my research. And throughout his career, he's released these songs before on big albums, often using them to signify the beginning of new eras. All five songs featured long, intricate verses, which are in the description, in which Kendrick takes stock of the world around him and reveals what issues have been occupying his mind at the time. Based on the themes in the heart part five, seems he's focused on the ideas of perspective and culture right now in the present, especially with Will Smith being in the video. The series has been ongoing for a decade. Part one was released in 2010. And part two served as the opening track and overly dedicated. Part three was recorded three days before the arrival of Good Kit. And part four dropped, I think, weeks before Damn. Now, helping to announce the impending product, these songs usually don't end up on actual albums, but Kendrick uses them because he's that type of artist to introduce each pro project because he calls them projects as they are preceded. Now, the heat of part five arrives at a pivotal moment for Kendrick. Here he's about to, well, we have to go back a year. Then he, when he dropped it, he was about to release his fifth album whilst under contract with the longtime label Top Drawer, Top, D-A-W-G Entertainment. And he's also transitioning to his new venture, PG Lang. Part five was released by TDE, but Kendrick also tapped PG Lang to help execute the video. Now, PG Lang is listed as, as one of the production companies who made the video. And PG Lang founder Day Free is credited as the executive producer and co-director. So we go to Oklahoma at the beginning of part five, this music video, there's a note. I am all of us, which I pointed out. That signed with the name Oklahoma. Kendrick used the same analysis to sign both of his recent letters about leaving TDE and dropping a new album. And it's also the name of his new website, everybody. It's in the description. We won't know for sure until the album at the time dropped and then it was confirmed. But 
it seemed Oklahoma is the name of the persona Kendrick adopted throughout Mr. Morale and the Big Stepper's Cycle, Eric. Now the culture, once again Kendrick changes us to appraise our collective moral compasses while spurning the notion of black death as culture. Gang lifestyle has been absorbed by corporations and naive youth who digest regional slang, dances and finger gestures but discard the human casualties and watch in what Kendrick in this video describes as the land where hurt people hurt more people. His first utterance of that, that culture emits weary sarcasm as he raps about the situation where homies don't fuck your baby mama once you hit the yard. In the next line he adds then somebody called and said you're, you're Lil. Nephew was shot down, the culture's involved. He starts off the second verse by repeating Jay-Z's and that's Beyonce's husband, I do this for my culture. It's a preamble from Izzo Hover, reaffirming the assertion from the video's title card, I am all of us, which you saw in the beginning, by rapping for the words, niggas going to work and selling work, late for work, working late, praying for work, but he's on paperwork. Now that's Kendrick's verse demonstrates there's no glamour in the gang or the lifestyle. That's why I switched off a lot of rap because of that glorification in videos, videos and I was very surprised Kendrick didn't adopt that. But this is the reason why, because he, he sees no glamour in that. And the glory can be as fleeting as a solitary moment that somebody snapped of you for a photo that ends up as your R.I.P. shirt. Kendrick reaccounts his pain over Nipsey Hussle's murder, rapping, I'm in Argentina, wiping my tears full of confusion. Water in between us, another peer's execution, then scrutinally encapsulates the cycles of grief that have black and brown people in quicksand. The verse says, to back that up, history repeats itself, makes amends and find a nigger with the same skin to do it, but that's culture. Crack a bottle, hard to deal with the pain when you're sober. By tomorrow, we forget the remains we start over. And that's the problem. Tupac's le legacy looms large in Kendrick's catalogue. One of Pac's most beloved songs is Changes, where talent crooned, that's just the way it is when reflecting on how uh, systemic oppression led to a morass of hurt people hurting people. But at the end of the second verse of part five, Kendrick asks us to think deeper about what we accept, what we embrace. For calling it culture, call it for what it is, murder, treachery, consp or consequences of white supremacy. But whatever we call the trauma, Kendrick recounts here, we should label it something that spurns us to value each other's lives more. Powerful, no? Nimsey Hussle in the music video for the for the, the Heart Part 5, Kendrick uses deep fake technology to morph into some of the most iconic and famous black men in modern history. We saw OJ Simpson, Kanye West, Jussie Mollett, Will Smith, Kobe Bryant and fellow LA rapper legend Nipsey Hussle. Some of the figures seem to have minimal relationship to Kendrick's lyrics. And after a first listen, but Kendrick uses the song's last verse to rap from the perspective of a beyond the grave Nipsey Hussle. This approach could have been fumbled or could have come across an explosive, <coughs> exploitive from a lesser MC, but Kendrick came from a place of respect here. He really did. R rhyming the perspective of the late rapper Kendrick wrenches the listener by pondering, should I feel resentful? I didn't see my full potential. Should I feel regret about the good I, that I was into? As he references the heartbreak of Nipsey dying in front of the store that symbolized his desire to be a pillar of his community. Kendrick picks up the verse into resilience by rhyming, to my father, to my wife, I'm serious. This is heaven, before advising Nipsey's friends to count their blessings, encouraging his fans to make them investments and telling Nip's brother 
Black Sam to make sure my kids watch all my interviews. Make sure you live the dreams we produce. And that struck me in the video. That was very powerful. And kept the genius and the brain on the move. The verse is based on Kendrick's interpretation that Nipsey would offer his loved ones reassurances and gems to keep going in his absence. Summed up by this line, I'm complicated, I'm sorry, I'm completed. My mission wasn't ready to leave, but fulfilled my days. My creator was pleased, Andre. Now the symbolism that was throughout that video centers around the idea of perspective. Using deepfake technology, Kendrick embodies the perspectives of OJ Simpson, Kanye West, Jussie Mollett, Will Smith, Kobe Bryant, and Nipsey Hussle. And in the first verse, Kendrick appears as himself as he raps from his own perspective. But then he opens the second verse by morphing into O.J. Simpson's face, while interloping J.C.'s iconic opening line from Izzo, however. Beyond the symbolism of O.J.'s rise to fame and fall from grace, there's also a subtle nod, nod to Hove rapping about O.J. on the story of O.J. Now Kendrick's face morphs into Kanye West next as he raps about a bi bipolar friend who is surrounded by opportunists that might be taking advantage of him. And I've seen that Kendrick in the latest A1 technology that people are using Kanye because his voice suits what they're trying to say about a this new A1 technology in the music business. You don't need producers or you can just take a voice and put it to music now. And they use Con Con Kanye West. And I find that intriguing. I find that disparaging because he's a great artist that shouldn't be undermined that way because what happens to all the rights of his, of his music? It's just something I wanted to bring into this. So he does get taken even by YouTube creators. Then he moves into Jussie Mollett hinting at the hypocrisy surrounding the controversy of a staging a racist and home homophobic attack. Kendrick closes that second verse by rapping in a land where her people hurt more people. Fuck calling it culture from the perspective of Will Smith, as we saw, who recently faced backlash when he slapped Chris Rock. Remember that, everybody? At the Oscars after the comedian made a joke about his wife, Jada Pinkett Smith's alopecia. When he's rapping from Kobe's perspective, Kendrick's lyrics hint at how they both changed their perspective games thanks to hard work and dedication. And as he closes the track, Dot channels the spirit of Nipsey Hussle, leaving a message to his loved ones about being in heaven, forgiving the man that murdered the late rapper and how he hopes his legacy will be carried on. Now the culture lies in the crux of all these portrayals, everyone, as Kendrick conveys these influence and polarizing black figures who are all part of the same whole. This point about fractured perspectives is given home by the opening title card that says, I am all of us. It could be interpreted that Kendrick uh, chose figures like OJ and Smollett to highlight how even unfortunate decisions are part of culture, for better or for worse. Now the aesthetics of the video uses simple, encouraging aesthetics encouraging views to focus on Kendrick's face and what he's saying which is absolutely perfect it's exactly what I was doing Kendrick and from the shoulders up with a solid background behind him which was great forcing our attention on his words and morphing face this prioritizes the lyrics it certainly did and enhances the stripped down sound of the second half of the song now the South Park connection creators Max Stone and Trey Parker are given special thanks in the credits of the video at the end and in 2020 Parker and Stone launched the deepfake studio when they made the viral video Sassy Justice. This isn't the first time Kendrick has been linked with Parker and Stone. Earlier in the year it was revealed that Kendrick and Dave Free are co-producing a live-action comedy film for Paramount Pictures with Parker and Stone. So there you go. It goes on. The title and the release date of the film has yet to be announced but will reportedly be about a black man who works as a slave reenactor at a living museum. Did we have a museum thing similar to that? I can't think. In the film, the man learns that he's a, descent, a descendant of slaves who were once owned by the ancestors of his white girlfriend. Now, the single artwork, the cover artwork for, 
for Heart Part 5 because it all needs to be incorporated. It depicts six photoshopped hands being held up. Upon closer inspection, each of these hands represent the perspectives that Kendrick is wrapping from in the video. The gloved hand on the right is taken from the famous picture of O.J. Simpson in his 1995 murder trial. The hand with the band-aid on is Kobe's after he won his fifth championship. Jesse Smollett's hand is taken from a photo of him walking to the trial, while another is taken from a photo of Kanye shunning paparazzi. The Heat Part 5 is all about fractured perspectives, living within the same culture, and the cover art extends those themes even further. Thank you for listening, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the video. I don't want to go any more than that. It's too deep. Thank you.